Following a long multi state investigation, a former Bell Chase resident is facing multiple sex abuse charges. The Plaquemines Parish Sheriff's Office made an arrest in that case that's more than a decade old. WDSU reporter Andy Cunningham has the very latest for you on the investigation from Bell Chase. Plaquemines Parish Sheriff investigators believe there are more victims out there, and as this investigation continues, they are asking anyone with information to come forward. 30 year old Matthew Wallace was extradited from Utah and brought to Plaquemines Parish this week to face child sex abuse charges that date back to 1999 when Wallace and his family lived on Brentwood Drive in Bell Chase. According to sheriff deputies here, his mother and father, who also live in Utah, recently admitted to destroying video evidence back then of the crimes and a now deceased bishop at a Harvey church absolved Wallace of his sins shortly after the alleged incidents when he was 15 and 16 and his victim was a girl between the age of four and five years old. While allegations surfaced years ago, it wasn't until May of this year when a victim came forward telling investigators that Wallace abused her at the home on Brentwood Drive and since then a second alleged victim has come forward. That's why investigators believe there could be even more victims. We're here for them. We're their advocate. You know, if they were a victim from Mr. Wallace or any other sexual victims, they need to come forward so we can seek justice for them and, and get them the help that they need to get. Now, Wallace only spent a couple of days in jail here on the charges he's accused of after posting a bond set at $100,000. Louisiana law, though, he probably only had to pay 12% of that. And it's believed he's already back in his home state of Utah. Reporting on your side from Bell Chase, I'm Andy Cunningham. Back to you.